Well, how do I look, Rumo? Like you always do, Betsy. Like trash. <laughs> Thanks. I just needed to hear you say it. Excuse me, is there a Betsy Baxter here? My family are simple people. They're not cultured enough to appreciate any kind of class. Okay, Ramon, plug me in. My most terrible time. I have two baseball players. They raped a fan. They make $2 million. They can't afford a hooker. My biggest hockey player has Bolivia up his nose. And in the middle of all this, you want me to take the kids for eight weeks? Be serious, Carol. Ben, Cleo, let's do it. You have the kids this summer. Figure it out. You drop this bomb on me now? No consideration for my work. Carol, if your mother's dying, don't you think the kid should be with her to share her final moments? She has Alzheimer's. She doesn't know who I am. She drools. She talks crazy. Think of the joy it would bring her in her final days. She gets violent, Sam. So what are you going to do? Stay with her? She dies or what? Yes. Oh, God. She could live for months. certain the sequence you gave us is correct? How many times do I have to tell you? Did you get the code yet? The numbers she gave us don't work. Dr. Andres, I thought you would agree to help us. It's glorious. Before, maybe a little after. Dimitri the trial began on May 28, 1996. In his opening statement, prosecutor Stephen Alexander said he would provide eyewitness testimony that on the night Dimitri died, he returned home around 8 p.m., an hour before his mother reported him missing. We have a witness. Why did you call a defendant? I called Ms. Perhaps the most important witness for the prosecution was newspaper reporter John Holland. I asked Miss Moore what she knew about the investigation, and uh, she said that she was infuriated that the police would think that she would smother and drown her own son in her bathtub. At any time, to your knowledge, did the police release any information about the drowning to the public? Hello, Dolly. Well, hello, Dolly. It's so nice to have you back where you belong. It's your... He thought the illness was dead. He was just lying in bed. Passed out on booze and methamphetamines. Oh, honey, honey. Oh, baby. 